Now, let's answer a question from random post. Pero hindi natin i-reveal kung saang post ito at kanino. Hindi ko rin alam kung anong grade ba ito. Pero ito ay basic ratio and proportion na alam kong makakatulong sa inyo. But before we will start, para sa first time pa sa channel ko, ito yung FB natin. Ito namang Philippine Civil Service Review for All. FB group ito kung saan pwede rin kayong mag-post sa mga questions nyo. Pwede rin kayong mag-share sa mga reviewers nyo. Regarding sa kung mag-post kayo ng mga question, marami din tayong mga FB members na haping sagutan yung mga tanong ninyo. At ito naman yung mga FB groups na lagi natin tinatambayan at FB pages na posibleng makatulong sa inyo. Now, dito na tayo sa basic ratio and proportion. But before that, basahin muna natin yung directions. Complete the table by writing each ratio in colon form and in fraction form and, in, and find the simplest form. So, ito yung example. 15 dalandan to 25 coconuts. Yung 15, yan yung nauna. At yung 25, yan yung pangalawa. So, in column form, it will be 15 is to 25. Yung 15, yan yung dalandan. Yung 25, yan yung coconut. In fraction form, yung nauna, yan yung numerator. Yung pangalawa, yan yung denominator. Simplest form. To convert this to simplest form, we just have to find the greatest common factor dito sa 15 and 25. Ang greatest common factor dyan ay 5. So, 15 divided by 5 and that is 3. Then yung denominator na 25. 25 divided by 5 and that is 5. Kaya yung simplest form ay 3 fifths. Now, dito na tayo sa number 1. 18 roses to 24 chocolates. Yung 18 yan yung nauna. Meron na dito. Yung 24 yan yung pangalawa. Now, in fraction form, yung 18 nasa numerator. Yung 24 nasa denominator. Now, to convert that to simplest form... Ang greatest common factor, by the way, meron tayong na-upload na na greatest common kung paano hanapin yung greatest common factor like maybe two days ago yata yung pag-upload ko. At marami na tayong dati nang na-upload. Ganito ang pag-search nyo. Idugtong nyo lang or isulat nyo yung lunalin tapos greatest common factor para madaling mahanap nyo yung dati na nating na-upload. Kasi nilalagay natin or binigay ko sa inyo yung Ways, mga siguro yung dati kong na-upload ay three ways of solving or finding the greatest common factor. Tapos yung latest na upload natin ay meron din tayong sinagutan lang kung paano hanapin yung greatest common factor. So now, dito sa 18 and 24, ang greatest common factor dyan ay 6. Greatest common factor ay 6. So, 18 divided by 6, and that is 3. 24 divided by 6, and that is 4. So, ang simplest form, dito sa 18 over 24, ay 3 fourth. Next, 21 girls to 28 boys. Ang nasa unahan, 21, is to, ang pangalawa, 28. Ngayon, given na yung fraction form, na yung nasa unahan, yan yung numerator. Yung pangalawa, yan yung denominator. Malis natin yan by finding the greatest common factor. Uulitin ko, mayroon na tayo na-upload na greatest common factor. Ang mga paraan kung paano ito hanapin. Now, sa 21 na 28, ang greatest common factor dyan ay 7. 21 divided by 7, and that is 3. 28 divided by 7, and that is 4. So, ang simplest form dito ay 3 fourth. Next, 8 ball pen and 16 pencils. 8 nasa unahan, 8 is to 16. Now, sa fraction form, itong nasa unahan, nasa numerator. Itong pangalawa na 16, nasa denominator. Now, malis natin yan by finding the greatest common factor. Ang greatest common factor sa 8 and 16 ay 8. 
8 divided by 8 and that is 1. 16 divided by 8 and that is 2. Kaya yung simplest form ay 1 half. Next. 15 battles to 60 cans. Ang ratio. In colon form, yung 15, yan yung nasa unahan. Yung 60, yan yung nasa pangalawa. Yung nasa unahan, yan yung numerator. Yung pangalawa, yan yung denominator. Now, to convert the six, uh, 15 over 60 to simplest form, we just have to find the greatest common factor, which is 15. 15 divided by 15, and that is 1. 60 divided by 15, and that is 4. Kaya ang simplest form dito sa 15 over 60 ay 1 fourth. Next. 56 is to 84. Isulat yung 56 is to 84. Si 56 yan yung numerator dito. Si 84 yan yung denominator. To convert this to simplest form, we just have to find the greatest common factor. Ang greatest common factor dito ay 28. 56 divided by 28 and that is 2. 84 divided by 28 and that is 3. So, ang simplest form dito ay 2 over 3 or 2 third. Again, kung paano hanapin itong greatest common factor, isearch nyo lang GCF Leonalin, idugtong nyo lang yung Leonalin para madali bang ma-sort out yung lahat na na-upload na natin regarding sa kung paano hanapin ang greatest common factor. Now, all I hope na mayroon kayong natutunan sa mga videos natin. Thank you and God bless.